Hmm. I guess you wanted it then. Roll the intro! Hey guys, Dan here from the Diamond Minecart. And welcome back to another Minecraft mod review. Oh my goodness, how long has it been since I've said that? What well, you wanted it, desperately apparently. But welcome back to Minecraft. I have been setting this up all morning and I am... I'm so excited to do this. <laughs> Way more excited than I thought I would be. And welcome back to the lab. The the new lab, I guess. I know I know you guys would be disappointed we didn't go all the way back, but I've kind of lost the old lab. It was in the middle of a desert and I forgot where it was. But if you like this video enough, then maybe, just maybe, I'll be able to source the map that will allow me to get back to the old lab. Now that would be some nostalgia. But yeah, welcome back. I know what you're thinking. What on earth is going on with my arm? Well, I decided to, um, well, I decided to put five mods in this one, I think. One of them being a mod that makes me look like a small bobblehead. So, um, I think it looks cute, but it makes my arm look weird. Speaking of weird, what's good, buddy? <laughs> welcome back. Aww. Where have I been? Um... I don't want to talk about it. Just been doing other things, you know. Hopefully, you've been keeping this place tidy. It looks pretty good, to be honest. And Grim's here as well. How you doing, buddy? Haven't seen you guys for ages. I can't even think how long it's been. So I guess we should probably just get on with this, right? I I'm gonna be rusty. I'm not gonna lie. So you're gonna help me out with this? Good. Let's go. I've actually spent the morning setting up four different mods that we can take a look at. Two of them being stupid, one of them being super awesome, and one of them doesn't quite work properly, but should be cool. So the first one involves, actually the first one involves my height and stuff. Because if I press this button right here, I can change the way I look, which is pretty cool. Also, since this is a throwback and you guys wanted an old school mod review, I'm back in my old skin. No dab police shirt. I've got everything back to normal, just like you guys wanted it. But if I press this button and go to edit, I can scale myself so I can make, I can even make my body like absolutely <laughs> huge. Bro, there is something wrong with me. <laughs> this is amazing. I look like a stretched minion. I actually look like Treyoros, we're not far off in proportions. I can also make literally everything ginormous, right? Do I become a giant? Oh yes, yeah I do. I kind of want to keep it all small though. I think I look cool with a bubble head, but it's just gonna mess up my, uh, it's gonna mess up my arm for a little bit. I can also add, uh, claws, ears, eyes, a fin. I can have a fin? Hold on a second. Yes! <laughs> Check this out, I've got a shark's fin. Yeah, I'm keeping that, it looks sick. Anyway, I can add loads of things. I can add beards, hairs, and all that kind of nonsense. It's a cool mod. All of these will be in the description. Anyway, let's move on to our first mod, because we've got a lot to get through. The first one is something to do with chickens. I can't actually remember the name of the mod, but it's, I think it's called Roost actually. But this is a cool one. The main reason I wanted to show you this is because of the chicken catcher. It just looks hilarious. And you also get an item that allows you to spawn in chickens. So let's spawn in a load of chickens right now. Let's get them all chilling, stand into attention. You guys can move if you want. You don't just have to, there we go. You don't have to stand there, don't be shy. So let's also put down some of these roosters right now. Um, there we go. Put some up here as well, break this. And then we want chicken breeder and then a roost collector. And then I think, I haven't tested out any of these mods by the way. This is way less prepared than I used to be back in the day, but that should make it more fun. Basically, I should be able to capture this chicken just like this, and then be able to place it, yes, inside, <laughs> inside the roost. That's amazing. Right, let's catch some more chickens, shall we? I'm gonna have to do it one at a time, because I'm in creative mode. Uh, we can put, we can just fill them all. Let's just do it. Give me, give me, give me. I don't know where all the chickens have gone. They've kind of just abandoned me. They're hiding, no wonder, because I'm putting them in their own little kind of vents, I guess. Let's put that there, that there, that there. I promise you, they're cozy. I swear, right, Treoros? Ah. See, this man does not lie. Come here. <laughs> I think I might have chosen the perfect amount of chickens. Let's spawn some more in, because I am going to need some more. Uh, bop, bop, bop. Perfect. So, let's fill this right here with chickens. And then this right here should collect everything that the roost produces. So it collects, I'm pretty sure it collects eggs and also feathers, but it should collect into the roost collector. I might actually move that to here because it kind of works in a nine by nine radius. So it just automatically collects them. You can also put uh, more than one chicken in here and you get the chicken breeder. What do I have to add here for it to work? Apparently I need seeds. 
Let's grab some seeds, shall we? Let's pop. Oh, wait. Wait. <laughs> no way. I think they're breeding. Treros, don't look. Look away. Um, mind you, they've got the curtains closed. <laughs> That's amazing. Where did you come from? Huh? What are you doing? Coming to watch the show, you sicko? Oh, look. He's cooking an egg. What's the middle one at? 48%. There's two in there, apparently. 50%. He's cooking. We can come back to these later and see what on earth these guys are up to. It says 0%. Let's put some seeds in there. Oh, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. It's a slow love process, but, um, yeah, Trust, don't look. It's rude. Come on, move along, buddy. Move along. <laughs> While that's brewing, we can go and check out our next mod, which is, I think, gonna be one of my favorites. It's the Melon Golem mods. That's right. I'm gonna grab all this stuff right here. Basically, what we need to do is stack three melons on top of each other. And we should be able to create our very own golems that are like snowmen in Minecraft already, or snow golems. But they're made of melons. If I grab this, have a stick in each hand, and right click. So I need to be wielding the sticks like this. Like an absolute, <laughs> like a terrible anime hero. Right click them, and they create little golems. How cool is that? Look at them, they're beautiful. And you can also give them different heads too. I'm go for a cacti head magma head, or just a chest. They don't do anything, but they look phenomenal. Y you're liking these guys? <sighs> yeah, slightly weird, I agree. But, but, what don't I have yet? What ones don't I have yet? Cobblestone and pumpkin. There's a standard one. But these guys, I don't think they really do anything in particular. They're just chilling, and I think they're pretty cool. Yeah, what, what do you think? Let's put this stuff back before I hurt someone with a stick, okay? Right, three cool mods down, two to go. But before we get on to that, um, I hope you're enjoying yourself. If you are, leave a like, that'd be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you're brand new. I want to bring Minecraft back. I've seen a lot of things while researching for this video, and I'm excited by this. If you want to see more Minecraft on the channel, let me know. That'd be greatly appreciated. Oh, and if you live in the UK, I'm going on tour very soon with a brand new live show. If you want to come along, buy tickets in the link in the description below. Greatly appreciated. Next mod is this. This thing is a portal to the void. That's right. I'm going to put it down, and I'm pretty sure it makes like a pocket dimension for you. So let's plop it. Should we put it on here? Yeah, there we go. Look at that. Looks shiny. Let's, um, oh! Uh, yeah, this is exactly what it was supposed to do. <laughs> so it kind of gives you almost like a room where you can do whatever you want. You could have stuff like, you know what, you could you could actually just bring a melon golem in here. Bop, 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 bop. There we go. So this guy will now just be uh, in here forever, and we can just go backwards and forwards. So you could, like, have loads of these. I'm pretty sure you could have loads. Is it a different one? Yes. Okay, you could have loads of these, label them up, and put, like, different farms in them. You could have storage in there. So imagine if you go into one of these. Wait, hold on a second. Hold on. What's going on here? I think I've broken it already. I, th <laughs> I think I've legit broken it already. Let's make loads and see what happens. Where am I going now? Yep. Yep, this one's green. Okay. This one is... This one's the one we've been in before. Great. <laughs> I'm lost between all my portals. They make different colors. This one's brown, but it's kind of in the same section. Oh! Oh, wait. I think I figured it out. If this one's here, if I put one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten across... It will be 10 across in the void. Look, that one's over there. Yes. So you can plan these out, give yourself massive chest rooms, do anything pretty much. You can have whatever you like. You could build a very small house, but have it have loads of voids. I thought this was a really cool feature. And in the future, I might use these. They're very cool. Useful if you like to create di diamond dimensions. It would have been useful for that, wouldn't it? Very useful. Are you guys done yet? I think they are. There's no exclamation mark. 54% done. They need to hurry up. Jeez. What about you? Are you done? I think he's done. Yeah, there we go. Look, eggs. Sweet. Two of them have had eggs and they get feathers too. I was right. And they look phenomenal. Look at them. <laughs> the happiest chickens in the land. Okay, last mod. I did mention that this was a little bit broken. And I, I think it's just because I can't figure it out. I've gone a bit um, dumb in my old age. But it's where you can create your very own Coca-Cola. Yeah, I'm not kidding. You find aluminum ore or aluminium, if you're saying it correctly, which gives you this, which is aluminum ingot. And then you need to create a carbonizer and a mixer. This is where I don't know what's going on. So I'm going to go into the creative menu. 
And we have vials of water, which are crafted by using three aluminium ingots and then one glass bottle. Then you fill it with water. But then there's stuff like condensed sugar, crystallized sugar, flavor packets, which are using sugar and paper and random stuff. What should we use? Let's use, yeah, let's use that one. The packet of harm. And I'm pretty sure you put it in the, the mixer. Put those in there, add some fuel, and then it starts to mix them up. And then you add what you get from this to the can in the carbonizer, and then you get a, a can of soda. But I think this is broken here, because it doesn't give me anything special. Let's put that in there, that in there, that in there. And it should give me a drink of something. But um, in case it doesn't, let's have a look at the different cans. Demonic can? Sure, I'll try that. Ancient soda? Sure. I'll take that too. Gold can, let's take that. Oh no, wait, I don't want the cans, I want the sodas. Okay, wait, hold on a second. Demonic soda, there we go. Ancient soda, gold soda, diamond, and normal. Okay, sweet. Grim, is it done? Yep, it didn't give me anything. Oh, there it is. What did it give me? A normal soda. Sweet, right? Let's go into game mode Zidda. If I could type. There we go, let's drink this and see what happens. They should give you different effects. Ow, ow, why would that hurt me like that? Are you kidding me? Oh, you can also change your model from the menu as well. That's quite cool. So if for this part I wanted some horns, I could I could definitely have some. There we go. Blue is the only color they should be. Oh, wow. That looks great. <laughs> That's sick. Okay, so that one hurts you. Let's try holy next. That gave me something. I'm not sure what it was, but it gave me something. What about gold? None of them are giving me anything. Ancient? This doesn't do anything for me. Demonic? I think they're supposed to give me some kind of... Some kind of things. What are they supposed to give me? Ah. Yeah, I thought so. They're not giving me anything. Now all I've got is eggs, melons, and random portals. Look at the mess we've created already. In our first mod showcase back. Amazing. Are you guys done yet? Oh, they're close. Okay, let's wait for this. 98. We need to get to 100, obviously. Here it goes. Hey! So it just creates literally another chicken, and then it consumes two of the seeds. Congratulations! Welcome to the world, little friend! How beautiful was that? To bring a tear to your eye? Wow, you don't cry, do you? Didn't think so. I'm still confused by these sodas. Wait. I think this one's just broken, you know? It just broke everything. But guys, we're back. We're back in the lab, and it's up to you whether we come back again. Oh my goodness, you scared me. And what is going on here? Come on, guys. Behave yourself. I know it's been a while, but geez. You good? Good. Have a soda. So we created soda, created portals, created melon golems, and we made a wall of chickens that are um, both breeding and creating beautiful eggs. Let's go. Not lucky enough. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for all the likes on Twitter. I didn't realize it would get that many. I honestly didn't think it would get to 10,000, but you absolutely smashed it. And if you guys want me to try and find... Hold on a second. Hold on. Trust, can we, um, can we locate the old lab? Do you know who owns it? No, he doesn't even want to talk about it. He's a little bit embarrassed. But um, if we get if we get enough support on this video, then we'll go back and try and find the old lab and do a real classic adventure, mod review, whatever. Let me know by leaving a like on this video. Let me know in the comment section below if you enjoyed this. And I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. I forgot to add an emote mod because I'm an idiot, but I've got horns. That's all you need, right? Look at me. Look at me. I look beautiful. But thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye. Wagon, candle, canvas, sofa, fork, rubber band.